throughout history, since the 10th century BC, so 1,000 years BC, Syria has been a crossroads of empire and civilizations. And of course, it's been at the end of the Silk Road from China. It's been at the crossroads between um, Eastern Europe or Europe and Arabia, uh, the crossroads from Central Asia to Egypt and Africa. So these empires have brought with it this huge richness of culture and philosophy and art and architecture. And if any of you have been to Syria before the conflict, you will have been, if you've been to Palmyra or places like that, you will have seen in the great temples, you will have seen Greek temples and Greek towns and um, uh, Roman towns and what have you. But you will have seen there are stone lintels which have Aramaic, Assyrian, Greek, Latin, all on one stone that are 2,000 years old. So this mix of cultures and um, trade and so forth. What this also did actually has brought into the Syrian psyche very much a sense that throughout history, throughout Syria's history, Syria has been um, dominated and occupied by other powers. And one of the, many th one of the things that many Syrians say of all um, political um, and uh, communal um, identities in Syria will say, we don't want other people directing what our country is going to be. We in the West are remembered in the Middle East for our tendency to go and dominate, destroy, and try and control. And that's still the, the Crusades. Western Christians went with a banner to try and liberate the Jerusalem from the infidel. And in the process, we massacred in thousands, tens of thousands of Muslims, Christians, and Jews who were all Arabs because we didn't know that they were Arab Christians. Vast numbers, of big numbers of Arab Christians and Arab Jews, of course, in the whole region. The Le Levant was a very cultural, rich mix of societies and religious faiths in which, for the most part, Muslims and Christians lived together with a degree of, of tolerance, which with, with a large degree of tolerance. The last hundred years has been um, disastrous for the, whole, for the whole region. Our interventions within the Middle East within the last hundred years are acutely ingrained within Middle Eastern psyche and society.